Not everyone's going to be happy with Grand Valley Transit's new busing schedule. It's going to make a lot of us walk and we are always dependent on the bus. You know, if you don't have a phone or a car, it's going to be harder. But a series of time extensions and reductions to evening bus service will go into effect on August 5th. The list of extensions includes 1 and 6 now running until 8.05 at night, along with 2 running until 8.35. Run times were shortened to the remaining routes, many of them cut down from 10 p.m. We're still in tough economic times. We're trying to make the service as efficient as possible while maximizing it to provide the best customer service possible. But if the bus is running till 10 o'clock at night and there's only a few people using it, that doesn't always help justify keeping the bus on route. The transit already does not run on Sundays, and the reduced hours are leaving many who go to school or work odd hours feeling left behind. I may have to walk halfway home. I may have to walk a couple of miles at 9 o'clock at night, 10 o'clock at night to get home. It gets me where I need to go. You know, I'm about four or five miles away from work, so when I can't catch the bus late at night or on Sundays, I have to walk, and it's about an hour and a half walk. Regional Transportation Manager Todd Hollenbeck says Grand Valley Transit constantly surveys the routes to find the most efficient means of travel and operation, and found the hours could be better distributed. We found that based on the surveys that folks in the morning uh, are really needing those services to get to and from work. Uh, the folks in the evening have a little bit more flexibility and not everybody's using the service to get to work. According to Hollenbeck, the changes will save about $100,000 for the year. Only 30000 of that is local money, the rest is from grants. However, that will be put back into the transit's funds for things like bus replacements in the future.